I mean, do I put the light on you? Get the glare off. Do it? No. You might have to roll the window up. Like, why does that? What enough? Look. The universe as a collective whole that's something to think about. But everybody would like everybody would like Cause then that feels like perspective makes everybody think about it differently, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You end up on different side of the of the spectrum based on your fucking experiences and shit. Yeah. Cause if we just think about it like <clears throat> I get it. Think about it as like an experience. Had. But <clears throat> experience at what ends though? Like, what's the point of this experience? Like, and what's the final experience? You want to what? You want me to? Uh, if you want to, you can. For sure. I give up. That shit's just going to stay. Over. Light shining and beam lights on it, Bambi and shit, you know, like T said. Self-esteem. That's what just popped up in my head. <laughs> Fucking self-esteem and how to get it and how to raise it. Well, we all have self-esteem because it's a spectrum. Appreciate it. How do you? How do you even get that? You pass it to me. Me personally, I feel like you wake up in the morning and saying you do whatever it takes to get yourself together. <clears> you look <throat> in the mirror and you say, "God damn, I'm gorgeous." And you don't think about what nobody else says about you. You just take care of what you think is wrong with you. Well, something is hurting me, huh? but because it just feels, oh, the perspective is like, oh, yeah, you just turn it down, and then that's all, and then when you're ready to turn it up, <laughs> turn it up, that's all I'm saying, but anyways, I'm talking about what was self-esteem, how to get it, how to raise it. That's what I would do, just look in the mirror, do self-affirmations and Yeah, shit. I'm definitely looking in the mirror. Mm. <laughs> and it's all about raising our thoughts honestly it's because that's how you get high self-esteem i think about if you like the things that you think about if you like the things that your mind creates and like the way like life looks i mean but how would you know that and unless you study yourself right exactly mm. exactly what the heck do you ever feel like a sensation <clears throat> and you're like you gotta chase that feeling yeah because that's how the vibes is all the time it's just like it's always like we want something new we want something next and that's the thing about the um the people oh yeah sorry <clears throat> let me talk about this <laughs> the fucking people they just want to do something. They want something new. Yeah, no cap. Like, you. what's next? We got to give them what's next. I say, anarchy is next. That's what I say. Me personally. That's what it is. Get again. But really not. Not that stupid shit everybody said about was just dumb vandalism. You know, a bunch of illegal stuff. Wall breaking, murdering, mayhem. Not that. I mean, where everybody is like peaceful, you know, this big place where everybody is, and everybody's like, "Hey, if you need something, I got you. If you got something, can I ask you?" If you say no, it's like, "I right, appreciate it, cool." Then I know if I'm giving it to this person, I'm giving it to him for no reason. Nobody's mad about that. Nobody's taxing each other. You know, we're not store, we're not storing a bunch of stuff for no reason because of no reason to. That's of anarchy where everybody's just chilling. Yeah. No political reason. And everybody has free will. 
to do what they want to do because it would be great if you could just accept it and that's the one thing you got to learn is about like self-love and shit yeah <clears throat> just accept it huh yeah just enjoying it for ourselves and not trying to give it away to somebody else that's all that is that's, I think that's where like the miscommunication comes from because so many times people just be trying to give people the feeling that they want, but in reality you gotta keep the feeling or not keep it, but like give it to themselves. That's the feeling you want, so you give that feeling to yourself. <clears throat> but at the end of the day. Before you know any of that, you have already gave something out. Go feminism. Uh, what that mean? What <laughs> <laughs> cause, bro? What? Woohoo! <laughs> mm-hmm. Nah. <laughs> feminism. <laughs> Backhanded. It's like that shit is funny. That's feminism. You know what that is? Not for real. Oh That's a pimp, a pimp turn player, <laughs> Dude. bro. I don't know nothing about that shit. Not bad. That's been My bad. That was that went over wrong. But what I was saying is, maybe not go feminism. I, I was very excited for it, <laughs> but I think it's because of the boundaries. I like that's just like respect. But then like. I don't know if it goes the right way. Because mm. if respect goes back and forth, it's like, that's not how everybody feels. But I mean, is like, that, I is that that's how it's supposed to be, though, right? You mean you just, like, be happy with yourself, and that bugs and happy with that self. Yeah, just, you mean, no, there's no need to, like, switch back and forth or in, intertwine anything. You mean, just chill. Um, yeah. Generational curse breaker. Uh, <laughs> some people don't want to be femi- submissive. That's submissive and feminine. Is that the same thing? Nah. To me personally, no. I'm pretty submissive. <laughs> I beat your ass, yo. <laughs> oh, crap. Ah, what the fuck? That ass. Anyways, that shit is not the same thing. That's not the same thing. It's like not stroking ego. It's not, no, like, like. Bro, come on now. I'm pretty sure it's the same thing. I'm talking about as an ego, right? Mm. Terms of control, how the other one sees the other, the relations aspect, the dynamic. Yeah. Oh, was that for the other one? For no, no, it's a mess. Mm, I don't know. I don't. I, I can't. I don't have nothing to say about that anymore. Yeah, <laughs> but no, not like that. See, that shit just gives. It goes. It gives. I don't know, cause then that's how the oppression uh, continues in a way when they think about it. Not really, because if the submissive finds the right dominant, then they're chilling. If it's respect. Exactly. Mm. That's supposed to be. Right. But, like, how you gonna have two people that want to fight all the time? Through a shortcut? Huh? A shortcut? That would be cute. Uh. <laughs> that would be funny. That's funny. Wake up! Wake up! Because now it's time for... The end of the video. So how are you gonna close this out to all your fans? Mm. <laughs> all the people that love to see you. Wait, wait, wait yeah. They love to see you right there in the Mind your business. Uh-huh. Stay yourself. And stay true. I say <laughs> be encouraged. Learn a lesson. This is what I say. Learn a lesson from everything that you hear, say, or do. Look and pay attention to yourself. Because what you do and how you react is how your spirit is being affected. 
think about that. Because why the heck would... No, I'm not even going to say nothing like that. Because, bro. But I'm just saying. If you randomly start smiling, <laughs> extremely happy, you could wonder why you was happy. Mm. Why? Why would you do that? Because <laughs> you're smiling for no reason. You would know that you're smiling for no reason because you just made yourself smile. What the heck are you talking about? <laughs> you know why. Anyways, peace out. What are you going to say? Mm, I don't know. Mind your business, stay to yourself, and stay true. You know what's going on. Oh. <laughs>